we have the correct motor. And the motor I had on the other video was one we keep on the truck. We keep a, a 1310, 1311, a single stage and a two stage. So I guess somewhere in that 16, 2016, 2017 time frame, the train went from putting the hose for the pressure switch, putting the port for that on the front face plate of the heat exchanger to putting it on the front of the motor. The motor is exactly the same as the hole in the bottom like you saw in the other video for the water which drips and all over the burners and rusts everything out but they've moved the pressure switch hose here. I think the reason they did do that is because if, you have, if you've worked on any of the older train package units and saw where this was mounted it would rust and that thing would the the hose had the red hose on it would heat to the end of it stick to it you couldn't get it off and then that port where that thing plugs to that used to be there would break off or if you tried to get the hose off of it to clean your port out it would snap off and then you had to replace the whole heat exchanger so they stopped doing that and started putting it right here on this motor so i'm assuming that's the reason why that change was made other than that this motor is exactly the same no difference so other than that issue with where you stick your hose to for the pressure switch we got our gasket in here get everything lined up We'll get our motor in. screws back in and we'll plug it up and fire it off and if you saw the other video you saw how loud that thing was the racket and actually got louder as the thing ran longer as it heated up uh, you can compare and see the difference Black to black. Yellow to yellow. Hose port back on. Hose back up. And that's it. Pretty easy repair. Doesn't take very long. And let's go turn the power back on. And we'll run this thing. Jumper out. Yellow, get rid of green. Boom. 
white for heat, R for red. Big difference. I could have made it one video and not two. But uh, it threw me off with that little change in that motor. I mean, other than that, it's the same motor that I had. Just that hose port. So just keep in mind, there's two different versions of these package units. One has the hose that plugs to the front face plate on your heat exchanger. One plugs to the motor. So. Be aware of that before you take one apart and realize you have the wrong part going back in. It happens to the best of us. And I'm not the best by any means. I just do what I do to get through my day and try to do a good job. But anyway, guys, like, subscribe. Appreciate you watching. And uh, we'll see you the next time around.